Welcome to Backyard Forest School. I just love birdsong. There's so much of it around at the moment. I like to find a comfy space in the garden to sit or to lie down and listen. And I often close my eyes. That way I can hear more clearly. Should we have a go? Let's see what we can hear. Even in just those few seconds, I heard lots of different sounds. Some high, some low, some quick sounds, and some slow. Sometimes you might find that bigger birds make louder sounds, and smaller birds make high pitched sounds. And bigger birds like blackbirds and wood pigeons, or some smaller birds like robins and dunnocks and wrens and blue tits. The main birds in my garden that I hear are thrushes, blackbirds, robins, great tits and some house sparrows in the hedge. At forest school we hear lots of birdsong in the woods. Sometimes at forest school I bring my birds. This can help us through a bit of bird call identification. These are soft toys and inside is the recording of a real bird sound. This is a great tit. Let's have a quick listen. Ready? A bit like a U shape. Lovely. And a robin. I like to think of that one as the figure of eight. A green finch. Quite a noisy one. Blackbird. Quite melodious. Chaffinch. House sparrow. They're all so different. Quite a loud one here, the song thrush. Beautiful. It's even got an owl, a tawny owl. Reminds me of the night time. Now to finish, look, this is a sound you may not be familiar with. Woodpecker. Lovely, that's a greater spotted woodpecker. Great, I hope you've enjoyed that. Find a really cosy spot in your garden. Maybe something to lie on or sit on. Close your eyes and listen to the birds. See you next time.